Okay guys, it's uh, Jess and Danny from Into the Woods Adventures and uh, it's April 30th, 2022. It's a beautiful spring day so we thought we'd um, do some adventuring. Um, we are somewhere on Six Mile Lake. I don't really know where. We just sort of got in the water and paddled. We ended up here. Uh, so beautiful uh, lake, there's some cottages around but we found some nice uh, just kind of spot to have a fire and stuff. So. I wanted to tell you about our new fire starter. So uh, this is a Dixie cup and there's a little bit of loose wood there. So it's got some wood chips inside and uh, the wood or the paper itself is like just a, um, you know, biodegradable kind of paper cup. And what we've done is we filled it with wood chips and wax, which we just happened to get at the dollar store. And um, they are fire starters and that is our fire. And it is fantastic. So these are a 10 out of 10. So we filled them up halfway with wood chips, which we just got at our local kind of farm supply store in a massive bag for, you know, under $10. Halfway, pour wax on top, more wood chips on top, more wax, and then the end result is this. And uh, this is the first time we have tried them and it is absolutely fantastic. So definitely gonna recommend that you make up some of these. They're pretty lightweight. They're not gonna take up a lot of room in your pack if you're doing some backcountry stuff or a lot of portaging. And uh, you'd probably need one for say every fire you plan on starting. So depending on how you plan on doing that, um, most likely in the evenings you need kind of one per fire. But definitely gonna recommend that you make up some of these. So they're super easy to take with you and uh, they completely burn down and uh, last for quite a while. So uh, great. Um, idea there that we had found on um, the interwebs but and the other thing I wanted to share with you today was our portable stove so it is a uh, grizzly wolf uh, stove or wolf grizzly I don't know which way you say it um, grill sorry not stove and um, it comes in a nice little pack it is uh, not super heavy so it's pretty easy to take with you backpacking uh, it's about two two and a half pounds or so and um, it's easy to yeah take on kind of all of your adventures. We take it with us um, most weekends, especially if we're going to do a little fire. Uh, today we have some sausages that we're just going to do over the fire. And I'm gonna show you how it goes together. So this, um, when it comes out, comes out like this. And um, basically this was about $150, $175, somewhere in there. And you can get bigger ones, but it folds out just like this. And you'll see like the little knobs on the top here that, um, they go into so it's gonna fold down on me here which is fine um, I'm just gonna prop it up like that and then this rolls out okay and then we have our little uh, middle section here that's going to uh, go like that so you kind of clip it onto the last rung here and then these are the um, things that we're going to just kind of hold in here so the higher you want your stove the closer you put it to the grill sorry your grill like you calling it a stove the higher you want your grill you're going to put it closer to the grill um the further down you're going to kind of put it in this sort of last little run okay so they clip in like this you can see it's super easy to put together uh and it's pretty fast you don't really need anybody else to do it for you and then uh it's ready to go so that's that it goes right over top of our fire like so and then the nice thing about it is that you can adjust it as required. So again, if you're wanting to have a little bit of a lower fire, you're just gonna bring them out so it's lower to the fire. Uh, but what I love about it is that it's portable. It rolls up into a tiny little package. It's not heavy, so you can take it backpacking on long trips, portaging, anything like that. And uh, it's easy to clean. We just kind of wash it off with some camp soap that we have or a quick little wipe down and then we roll it back up and it's ready to go. So and this is definitely one of our favorite products. It's an investment because it is a little bit expensive, but it's 100% worth it. Within probably one summer, if you're pretty active outdoors on most weekends, you'll have completely sort of paid it off in the number of uses that you have for it. So definitely recommend getting yourself one of those. Uh, it is great for any kind of camp adventures. Uh, the other thing that we have today, making our adventure quite uh, comfy, is our hammock. If you don't have one of these, you need to get one. Like You honestly have no idea what you're missing. Uh, they're not ex uh, expensive at all. Um, $30 or under is probably what you would spend on a hammock. And uh, you can see we just found two trees, tied it up to the trees, and hung it there. Uh, we take these with us most often instead of bringing chairs with us because, again, it rolls up into the little pouch, which you can see 
here at the bottom. So this is what it actually rolls up to and fits in. So again, a couple pounds in your pack and you have a um, spot to lay down and have a nap or sit down and have your lunch. Um, but definitely something else that we kind of bring regularly. So those are three of the things that we have basically with us today that are going to make today just super enjoyable and uh, a really nice day out on the water. And uh, yeah, I would highly recommend it. I uh, hope you love those things and I hope you get out and into the woods today too. See you next time.